the whole world's a stage, and this particular stage has been shredded. It's my shredded stage. Still cleaning up bits, but yeah, some of the bigger pieces have already cleared out. It's only day two, or yes, day two. Anyhow, new piece I started on Friday to memorize. I really like it, but I must admit that the activities or the show put on by nature the last few days has been uh, distracting. Anyhow, here's the bit. This is Hamlet speaking. I will tell you why. So shall my anticipation prevent your discovery and your secrecy to the king and queen, molt no feather. I have of late, but wherefore I know not, lost all my mirth, forgone all custom of exercises, and indeed it goes so heavily with my disposition that this goodly frame the earth seems to me a sterile promontory. This most excellent canopy, the air, look you, this brave overhanging firmament, this majestical roof fret it with golden fire. Why, it appeareth as nothing to me but a foul and pestilent congregation of vapors. What a piece of work is a man! How noble in reason! How infinite in faculties, in form and movement! How express and admirable in action! How like an angel in apprehension! How like a god! The beauty of the world! Paragon of the animals! And yet to me, what is this quintessence of dust? Man delights, not me. No, nor woman either. Though by your smiling, you seem to say so. Very nice to get a piece right. So, this is the scene today. We've lost major trees in this park, which is a very tiny park. What's interesting is the biggest tree that went down is what they call the flame tree. It has these beautiful red flowers. There's a number of them in, in this area, and all four of them, I think, right here, have all broke this year. So it was there, that was it for them. And uh, actually, there's, you can't see them, there's two more flame trees here, so that's kind of cool. Um, yeah, represents change, which I'm always adverse to. <laughs> That's something to work on very much.